Hi everyone, welcome to Bonnie Carolee Makes Cards. I'm glad that you were able to join me today. This card features beautiful digital images from Gracie Ellie's new release, Hey Beautiful. I love the combination of the colored Gallic rose with the silhouettes of the two branches. I started this card with Nina Solar White 80 pound cardstock. I used Distress Oxide Ink Scattered Straw, Worn Lipstick and Picked Raspberry to create an ink smooshed background. When using this technique, I like to apply the color one at a time. My preference is to have the color evenly distributed. When the sheet of cardstock is completely dry, I weight it down with heavy books. My paper is relatively flat and I'm able to put it through my printer easily. The rose is colored with Copic markers. For the flower petals, I used RV17, 13, and 11. YR30 is used as my lightest tone to create highlights. As is typical for me, I color my petals darkest to lightest. I use a flicking technique which helps me move from one color to the next. Sometimes I have to use little tight circles and apply a lot of ink to blend two colors together. That was not the case for the coloring today. The colors that I chose blend very easily and I was able to get away with just two layers of ink. I apply my deepest color at the base of each petal, but I also pay attention to how the petals overlap. I add in shadows in these areas and also on the creases on the petal's edge. I don't get too hung up on shadows and highlights and worry about the source of light and how it will play across my piece. What I do try to work towards is creating dimension. The coloring of the flower petals is pretty repetitive. The clips will show the progression to completion. I'll pop on the music for a minute or so until I have completed coloring the petals of the flower. I colored the flower center using Y06. I used E57 to do all the nooks and crannies around the stamens. I adhered this panel to black cardstock that was size four and a quarter inches by five and a half inches. When attaching the panel to the card base, I like to use a precision square that I have. It is actually a laser square that is intended for lining up sentiments, which I use periodically, but I use it mostly to ensure that I get my panel on straight. To finish up this card, I embellish it with Nouveau Crystal Drops, Buttermilk, and Shimmering Rose. And that will complete this card featuring Gracie Ellie Designs' new release, Beautiful Day. Whether you are watching this video on YouTube or on my website, I appreciate the time that you have taken out of your day to pay me a visit. Thank you so much.